<laughs> hmm. What's going to be my next research topic? Elevators? Hmm. Wait, if buildings have stairs, why do people need elevators? Are people just lazy? Hmm. What if elevators were never invented? Delete elevators, yes. I wonder what Structure Friend thinks about my simulation. Hello, Struc... Oh. What? What's wrong? I just... climbed all the way... to the 20th... floor. Oh! Wait a minute! Did you do this, Cosmo? Are you running a simulation? Uh, I wanted to see what would happen if <gasps> elevators had never been invented. I think I'll lay down until you're done. So, this is an elevator. The only part of an elevator that people see is the metal box they ride in. At the top of the elevator shaft is a pulley. A pulley is a simple machine made of a wheel with a cable looped around it. In an elevator, one end of the super strong cable is attached to the elevator box and the other end of the cable is attached to a counterweight. The counterweight reduces the energy needed to move the elevator. An electric motor moves the elevator up and down. When the motor turns one way, the elevator is lowered. If the motor turns the other way, the elevator is raised. The first passenger elevator was installed in 1857 in a New York City department store. It was powered by a steam engine and traveled super slowly, only 40 feet per minute. Things sure have changed. The world's fastest elevator is in the Guangzhou CTF Finance Center in China. It travels 100 times faster at 4,134 feet per minute. Whee! So, what would change if elevators hadn't been invented? There are lots of other ways to get from floor to floor. Escalators, stairs, slides, and fire poles. But not everyone can use all these methods. If elevators didn't exist, people using wheelchairs, pushing baby strollers, or with any number of health conditions would have trouble moving higher than the first floor of a building. Climbing the stairs is a great way to stay in shape. If elevators didn't exist, people who can climb the stairs would get plenty of exercise. Unfortunately, people sometimes trip and fall down the stairs. Ouch! Since elevators are safer than stairs, without elevators you would see more injuries. Huge buildings have different floors with different functions. In a hospital, the emergency room, the x-ray room, and the operating room might be on different floors. If elevators didn't exist, patients would need to be carried up and down the stairs instead of being pushed safely and comfortably in their beds to the elevator. When we construct buildings, we take away land from farms and forests. By constructing tall buildings with elevators, more people can live on less land. If elevators didn't exist, buildings would be no more than 10 stories tall. Instead of buildings growing up, buildings would grow out. This would leave less room for farms to grow food and less space for wild animals. Ah, uh, I didn't realize that elevators helped create Earth's modern cities. End simulation. Elevators are so important that every building that's more than one story should have one. This way, everyone can access all parts of a building. Thanks for your help today, and sorry for making you climb all the way to the 20th floor. It was good exercise. Bye! Bye! Hmm, which chapter should I research next? Hey everyone, Cosmo here. Elevators rely on a simple machine called a pulley. What if 
you could build your own simple elevator. Step one, find an adult. Step two, gather your supplies. An empty toilet paper roll, a small paper cup, string, pencil, tape, and a small toy. Step three, using the pencil, punch three evenly spaced holes around the edge of the cup. Step four, tie three short pieces of string into each hole. Knot the string together about four inches above the top of the cup. Step five, tie one end of a long piece of string to the knot and wind the rest of the string around the toilet paper roll. Leave a four inch tail of string to move the elevator. Step six, tape one end of the pencil to a door frame. Put the toilet paper tube on the pencil. Step seven, put the small toy in the cup. Now pull the string to lower and raise the cup. You just made an elevator. Happy building. And I'll see you next time on What If Kids. Goodbye!